If you aspire to own a 2 BHK in the plush area of Navi Mumbai's Vashi and that too at competitive prices, then stay tuned with me, Chetna Sadadekar. What's more, well, the construction of the project I am reviewing today is already halfway. So, without a further ado, let's head to Gami Jade, a new project by Gami Group. Gami Jade is situated in Sector 26 of Washi, which is close to the APMC market, popularly known as Washi Market. Though it falls in Navi, Mumbai, the locality can be easily accessed from the eastern and central suburbs of Mumbai within half an hour to 45 minutes. Gami Jade is a ground plus 25 storey structure with 23 commercial shops and parking spaces from the ground to third floor and residential spaces on all the remaining floors. All floors from 4th to 25th have 8 units barring the refuge areas. The developer is offering 1.5, 2, 2.5 and 3 BHK apartments in this project. There are multiple carpet areas that range from 436 square feet being the smallest size that goes up to 852 square feet being the largest size in this project. The prices start at Rs 1.04 crore onwards. The project is Vastu compliant with units facing east and west and there is also special attention paid to ventilation. You get a view of the cityscape from two sides, APMC market from one side while the other side offers a view of the mountains. The developer has planned amenities on the rooftop and a few on the 24th floor. Some amenities include a jogging track, children's play area, badminton court, landscape gardens, swimming pool and a party lawn. The project will have three lifts and a fire lift. Gami Jade is a rare registered project and the number is mentioned in the description box below. The project is slated for completion by 2025 but the speed at which the work is going on, the developers are promising an early possession. For a 25-storey building, the developer is already on the 16th slab of construction. As mentioned earlier, there are multiple carpet areas to choose from in this project. We will explore the carpet size of 436 square feet. On entering from the main door, you will directly step into the living room, which can accommodate a four-seater sofa set and a TV cabinet. But avoiding a separate dining area will help the living room look bigger. Just at the entrance on the right is a small room, which can be used as a study room or a small kid's room. Further ahead, in the apartment, you will have a kitchen which is hardly 56 square feet, lacks enough storage space and can accommodate your modular kitchen cabinets and space for refrigerator. Opposite this is a common toilet and a bathroom. Interestingly, the developer is offering a master bedroom concept with attached toilet and a bathroom. This bedroom can also easily accommodate a wardrobe and a bed. Please note that the developer will only provide vitrified floorings, fittings and bathrooms and toilets, kitchen sink and platform along with doors and sliding windows among others. Gami Group has an experience of more than two decades in the real estate industry. Gami Group has completed over 10 projects in various parts of Navi Mumbai and has four ongoing projects and three upcoming projects which two are in the neighbouring localities and sub-localities of Washi. Washi is one of the meticulously planned areas by the City and Industrial Development Corporation, also known as CIRCO, with all the necessary infrastructure in place. Let's take a look at the location and also check out the neighbouring projects. Following the development of Navi Mumbai as a separate city, Washi was one of the first areas developed with all the necessary social and retail infrastructure. The locality is, in fact, costlier than a few of the suburban localities of Mumbai. Proximity to Ghansoli, Rabale and Belapur, among others, are few of its USPs. The locality doesn't disappoint on the education front as Avalon School and Orchid School is nearby. 
in terms of the health care to popular hospitals such as Reliance Foundation Hospital and Portis Hospital are nearby. Further, in orbit mall and Palm Beach Cal area are easily accessible. Washi is very close to Mumbai suburban areas like Mankhurd, Chembur and Ghatkopal. Further, since the operations of Eastern Freeway commenced, reaching South Mumbai too has become easier for the residents of Washi. Gami Jade also enjoys proximity to the plush area of Palm Beach Road. The existing connectivity nodes include Thane Belapur Road and Sayan Panvel Highway for the connecting to Mumbai Pune Expressway. Washi Railway Station is located at 3 km whereas Chhatrapati Shivaji Maharaj International Airport is 24 km away. The upcoming Navi Mumbai International Airport is stationed at 22 km from here. There are cabs and autos available for the local commute along with NMMT buses. With the construction of the Mumbai Trans Harbour Link project in full swing, Washi has further become a lucrative market. The project will connect Shivri in Mumbai to JNPT. EV10 Marina Bay and Godrej Bay View are two of the under construction projects in Washi. Marina Bay offers 2 and 3 BHKs priced in the range of 1 crore 65 lakh to 2 crore 77 lakh. Godrej Bay View also offers 2 and 3 BHKs but in slightly bigger sizes which also command premium accordingly. Gami Jade is a competitive enough option and offers all the important amenities but the other two projects are a kilometer closer to the Washi station than Gami Jade. The locality is prone to heavy traffic during peak hours. Further there are issues of hawkers and retail vendors that come to pick bulk vegetables during the daytime as the APMC market is close by. The carpet areas of compact to BHK might seem small for many. However, there are a varied size options available to choose from. Not just this, the project also offers decent amenities, but the location of the project steals the show. So this was my review about the project and if you have any queries relating to the project, do write to me in the comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe to MB TV if you haven't already done it. Till we meet again this is Chetna Sadadekar signing off with cameraman Arpit Sharma